Let me tell you something surprising. One small evening meal, yes, just one, can change how your brain behaves while you sleep. Because while most people think sleep is about resting the body, the truth is your brain is still working, sorting memories, flushing toxins, resetting emotions. And if it doesn't get the right support, it doesn't rest, it races, it loops, it overfires. The result? You wake up tired, foggy, forgetful. A study published in Nature Neuroscience in 2022 found that disrupted nighttime brain activity leads to a 32% decrease in memory recall the next morning. That's not a theory, that's biology. And for older adults, it's even worse. As we age, our brain's ability to regulate those night waves weakens, especially if we go to bed on the wrong fuel or no fuel at all. But here's the good news. You don't need a pill. You don't need a new mattress. You don't even need to sleep longer. You just need to eat smarter before bed. Certain foods, humble, soft, familiar, can calm brain overactivity, support memory consolidation, and help you wake up sharper. Not in months, but in days. Comfort foods that have been on our tables for generations. But what if we've misunderstood them? What if they're not just soft foods for weak teeth, but neurological tools? Tools that work quietly while you sleep. In today's video, I'll walk you through exactly how each of these three familiar foods can reduce nighttime brain chaos and rebuild your memory network. Backed by science, made for real life. And if you're new here, welcome. This channel is where we break down real solutions for aging brains. No hype, no fear. If that sounds like something you need, consider subscribing so you don't miss what's coming next. Because once you understand how your brain responds to these foods, you'll never look at your evening plate the same way again. Let's start with the one that's probably already in your kitchen, but you've never thought of it as brain medicine and its quiet, calming power. We often think of rice porridge as comfort food, simple, bland, easy to digest, something you eat when you are sick or tired, but the brain sees it differently. For an aging brain struggling with nighttime overactivity, rice porridge offers one of the most powerful yet gentle forms of support. And the secret lies in how it influences both brain chemistry and electrical rhythms. First, let's talk about tryptophan. Rice is a natural source of this amino acid, which the body uses to produce serotonin, the chemical that makes you feel calm and safe. But serotonin is not just about mood. It is also the building block for melatonin, the hormone that tells your brain it is time to slow down, rest, and release tension. In a study published in the Journal of Neural Transmission in 2021, researchers found that increasing dietary tryptophan in elderly participants led to a measurable improvement in sleep quality and memory function within just two weeks. The subjects who consumed high tryptophan foods before bedtime showed fewer nighttime awakenings and better cognitive scores the next morning. But that is only the beginning. What makes rice porridge unique is how easily the body absorbs it. Warm, slow cooked, and soft, it requires minimal effort from the digestive system. That means no late night bloating, no indigestion, no hidden stress hormones like cortisol sneaking into your bloodstream. And this matters because cortisol is a known disruptor of deep sleep and hippocampal function, the part of the brain that stores and retrieves memories. When your stomach is calm, your brain can rest. In fact, a 2023 paper from the American Journal of Geriatric Psychiatry demonstrated that older adults who consumed high glycemic, easily digestible meals two hours before bedtime had up to 37% less nocturnal brain hyperactivity measured through EEG scans. That is exactly what rice porridge does. It creates a gentle insulin rise that helps shuttle tryptophan into the brain. It helps initiate the cascade of chemical signals that quiet your neurons. And by doing so, it prepares your brain to shift into delta wave sleep, the stage where memory consolidation happens. Let me give you a simple example. Edward, 76, began eating a small bowl of rice porridge at 8 call p.m. After just three nights, he reported deeper sleep fewer racing thoughts, and something unexpected. He remembered his grandson's birthday without needing a calendar reminder. That might sound small, but for someone with early memory loss, it is life-changing. And it is not just about memory. Rice porridge also supports emotional balance. It reduces nighttime cortisol. It improves serotonin tone. It lowers inflammatory cytokines that have been linked to cognitive decline in older adults. Now, how should you use it? 
Make it fresh. Use white rice or short grain brown rice. Cook it slowly with plenty of water until it becomes soft and slightly soupy. No sugar, no heavy toppings. Just a dash of sea salt or a few drops of warm plant-based milk if you like. Eat it warm about one hour before bed. A small bowl around half a cup cooked. That is all you need. When done right, this simple food does not just fill your stomach. It sends a message to your brain. You are safe. You can rest now. The world can wait. And that signal, quiet and subtle as it may be, is often all the brain needs to begin healing. Mashed potatoes. Few foods feel as familiar, as grounding, or as emotionally comforting as this soft, creamy dish. It is often dismissed as heavy or too starchy, but when used wisely and at the right time, mashed potatoes can become a secret ally for the aging brain. Let's begin with its effect on neurotransmitters. Potatoes are rich in a compound called pyridoxin, more commonly known as vitamin B6. This vitamin plays a key role in the conversion of tryptophan into serotonin. Without B6, the body struggles to complete this conversion, which means that even if you eat tryptophan-rich foods, they may not translate into calmness or improved sleep. A clinical study published in Nutritional Neuroscience in 2020 found that older adults with higher vitamin B6 intake had significantly better scores in both sleep quality and verbal memory recall compared to those with lower intake. The researchers noted a direct correlation between B6 levels and the brain's ability to maintain stable mood and sleep architecture. But mashed potatoes do more than support serotonin. They also influence GABA, the brain's main inhibitory neurotransmitter. GABA acts like a brake system for your mind. It tells overactive neurons to slow down. It calms internal chatter. It helps the brain shift out of stress mode and into restoration. Without sufficient GABA activity, the brain stays on high alert even when you lie in bed with your eyes closed. Potatoes, especially when gently cooked and combined with a small amount of fat, help promote GABA synthesis by stabilizing blood glucose and improving the transport of glutamate into neurological pathways where it can be converted into GABA. In a 2022 study from the Journal of Psychopharmacology, researchers observed that meals high in resistant starches like cooled mashed potatoes led to a measurable increase in evening GABA activity in older adults, particularly those experiencing mild cognitive impairment. And that matters because GABA is not just about sleep. It is about memory formation, emotional regulation, and preventing the runaway firing of neurons that leads to brain fog and forgetfulness. Mashed potatoes also offer another quiet benefit, magnesium. This mineral supports over 300 enzyme systems in the body, including those involved in nerve conduction and brain plasticity. In aging brains, magnesium deficiency is common and has been associated with increased risk of insomnia, anxiety, and short-term memory loss. According to a review in the Journal of Alzheimer's Disease in 2021, Adequate magnesium intake was linked to better cognitive preservation in seniors over a five-year period with lower incidence of neurodegenerative decline. So how does it all come together? Mashed potatoes, when prepared with care, provide a calming mix of slow-release carbohydrates, vitamin B6, magnesium, and brain-soothing starch. This combination helps stabilize blood sugar, support tryptophan absorption, and promote the steady flow of serotonin and melatonin. That means better memory, fewer racing thoughts, and deeper, more restorative sleep. To make them work for your brain, keep it simple. Use boiled potatoes. Add a bit of olive oil or unsweetened plant milk. No heavy cream, no aggressive seasoning, just warm, soft nourishment taken slowly about an hour before bed. Because sometimes brain repair doesn't come from pills or machines. It comes from a spoonful of something warm at exactly the right time. Pumpkin is rarely talked about in brain science. We think of it as something seasonal, something sweet, something to decorate, not to heal. But steamed pumpkin, especially when used regularly in the evening, offers a remarkable combination of nutrients that speak directly to an aging brain's most urgent needs, inflammation control, wave stabilization, and memory support. Let's begin with beta carotene. This bright orange pigment is more than just eye food. It is a powerful antioxidant that helps protect neurons from oxidative stress, one of the leading causes of age-related cognitive decline. 
As neurons age, they become more vulnerable to tiny bursts of internal rust, which build up over time and damage synaptic connections. A study published in Frontiers in Aging Neuroscience in 2020 showed that older adults with higher plasma levels of beta carotene had significantly better verbal recall, executive function, and attention span than those with lower levels. The effect was especially noticeable in individuals over the age of 70. But Pumpkin's real gift is how gently it works with the brain. It contains a natural form of magnesium, which when absorbed in the evening, helps the brain shift out of its reactive, overstimulated state. Magnesium regulates calcium flow into neurons, a key process that influences the creation and timing of brain waves. Without enough magnesium, neurons misfire. They stay active longer than needed. They prevent the transition into deep sleep. And over time, this repeated overstimulation leads to exhaustion, forgetfulness, and irritability. In a clinical trial published in the Journal of Clinical Sleep Medicine in 2021, elderly participants who increased their dietary magnesium saw a 31% improvement in sleep onset latency, meaning they fell asleep faster with fewer nighttime interruptions. Those same participants showed sharper performance in short-term memory tests taken the following day. Steamed pumpkin is also a gentle fiber source, and that matters more than most people realize. Why? because gut health and brain function are intimately connected through the vagus nerve and microbial byproducts. A balanced gut promotes the production of short-chain fatty acids, which play a direct role in reducing neuroinflammation and supporting mood balance. Pumpkin's soluble fiber supports this microbial environment without causing gas or discomfort, a critical feature for older adults with sensitive digestion. Its natural sweetness also provides a small glucose release, not enough to spike insulin, but just enough to signal safety to the brain, a condition necessary for parasympathetic dominance. That is the state where healing happens, where memory consolidates, where emotional processing completes, and it all happens while you sleep. Let me give you a quick real world example. Marjorie, 73, started eating a small serving of steamed pumpkin with dinner. Within a week, her daughter noticed something subtle. She was finishing her sentences again. Her eyes looked clearer, her mood more stable. That is not magic. That is nutrition meeting neurology. To prepare it right, choose fresh pumpkin, peel it, cut into cubes, steam until soft but not mushy. No sugar, no butter, just a pinch of cinnamon if you want a natural calming lift. Eat a small portion, no more than half a cup with your evening meal, not as dessert, not as a treat, but as a tool. Because when you feed the brain what it truly needs, not stimulation, not sugar, not shortcuts, it responds, not with fireworks, but with clarity. And for many older adults, that quiet return of mental sharpness is more powerful than any headline. Knowing what to eat is one thing. Knowing when and how to eat it, that is where the real healing begins. Because your brain does not respond to nutrients in isolation. It responds to timing, to rhythm, to repetition. The older the brain, the more it depends on structure to feel safe enough to rest. So if you want to calm brain over activity and support memory while you sleep, it is not just about the food. It is about the ritual. Begin by looking at your evening in three phases. The first phase starts early, around 6 p.m. This is when your body is still digesting the events of the day. It is also the best time to introduce steamed pumpkin. A small portion alongside your dinner supports gut balance and begins the shift into calm. The magnesium and fiber start working slowly without rushing the system. About one hour later, around 7 p.m., prepare your mashed potatoes. This should be light, half a cup at most, smooth, warm, and easy to digest. The starches in B6 will help your brain begin producing more serotonin and GABA. Do not rush through it. Eat with attention. Let your body understand that night is coming. Finally, around 8 p.m., serve your rice porridge. This is the final signal, the last message to your nervous system that it is safe to slow down. Keep it plain, a gentle texture, no added sugar, just enough warmth to settle the gut and ease your brain into pre-sleep mode. And then, no screens, no heavy conversations, just quiet. Let the chemistry do what it was designed to do. This three-stage approach might seem simple, but it mimics the natural descent of brainwave activity. From alertness to calm to rest, 
Each food plays a role. Each one lowers the volume inside your mind just a little more. Repeat this routine for a week, then two, then let it become part of how you close your day because healing does not always need to be dramatic. Sometimes it is a quiet shift, a gentle slowing, a soft, warm bite that tells your brain tonight you are allowed to rest. And when that message becomes consistent, the results follow. Sharper mornings, clearer thoughts, less fear of forgetting. It all starts with the way you end your day. Your brain is not broken. It may be tired. It may be overstimulated. It may be carrying more stress than you realize, but it still remembers. And when you give it the space to slow down, when you feed it with the right signals at the right time, something beautiful happens. It begins to heal, not all at once, not overnight, but quietly, consistently, and in ways that matter. You find words more easily. You sleep more deeply. You recall conversations, names, moments that used to slip through your fingers. And none of it comes from force. It comes from rhythm, from warmth, from returning to the basics of how the brain works best in stillness, not in chaos. This is not about being perfect. It is not about following a strict routine or chasing some miracle. It is about listening, respecting the simple truth that your brain, even now, still wants to work for you. It just needs you to stop overwhelming it. Every bite you take before bed sends a signal. It either says panic or peace. What you have seen in this video are foods that whisper peace. Foods that tell your nervous system you can let go now. You are safe. You can sleep. You can remember. And when those signals repeat night after night, the mind responds. If you have stayed with me until now, thank you. It means you care. It means you are trying. And it means you are not alone. If this video gave you something to think about or something to try, I hope you will leave a comment below. Share your thoughts. Share your progress. You never know who you might inspire. And if you know someone who could benefit from this message, send it to them. Like the video. Subscribe if you are new. This channel is here for people like you. Thoughtful, courageous, and committed to aging with clarity. Your brain still remembers. Let's help it rest so it can remember even more.